Good morning, Quadcopter 101, and I got something neat for you today. Um, yes, this is what you see in my left hand. Here is my old SEMA X5C, uh, my original keeper. Uh, well, one of my original keepers, the other one being my uh, WL Toys V212 and V222 and V262. I still got those too. Uh, but recently, you may have seen a video I did on this new little micro camera, the Ishin EF01. This thing is so neat, in my opinion. Uh, the main reason being it can operate on less than 5 volts, on 3.3 volts or 3.6 volts, I believe, uh, low, lower power limit for this camera. What that means is, what that translates to is, you can plug into the power ports on your cam your camera power ports on your little toy grade quadcopters, like I did here, to power this camera and turn your just about any of your camera toy grade camera quadcopters into an FPV quadcopter and that's what I'm going to do today I'm actually going to be flying it using these Ishin One goggles uh, I like these goggles because they have such a big screen <laughs> lots of big wide view now what's you know there are a lot of all-in-one FPV flyers out there already in the toy grades you know you'll see 5.8 gigahertz and then you'll see Wi-Fi FPV flyers but nearly all of them use these little pinhole cameras and when you try to fly FPV with them it's like trying to fly FPV looking through a soda straw this on the other hand has a very nice lens an 800 TVL lens a wide-angled lens that should make FPV flying very easy um, you have a wide field of view so if you want to do turns around uh, um, obstructions and uh, pylons or whatever if you're racing you'll be able to see them instead of smacking into them at the last second you know you'll, you'll see them off the peripheral side uh, using your peripheral vision with this wide-angle lens as opposed to the toy grade FPV flyers. Um, with that in mind, that's why I want to use these goggles. They have very big screen. So, this, you know, it's, this is a 1080p, you could actually view 1080p videos with this particular uh, Ishin One goggles, which are pretty darn nice in my opinion. So, let's go for a flight of my old CMAX 5C and see how it performs um, in FPV. By the way, I've done over a hundred flights with this, maybe even more. <laughs> and these are all the original motors. One thing about that I, I stress to try to stress to people, and and you know, it's pro I proved it with this one here, is if you check your props before and after each flight, especially these geared propeller quadcopters, um, your motors will last much longer, as this one can attest to. So let's go for a flight. Hope you enjoy it. Okay. Um, I have signal, as you can see here, showing the signal, <laughs> the FPV signal. I'm also recording using this over here, my old Sky 702 uh, diversity receiver, so you folks can see what I'm seeing. But let's go for a flight of the CMAX 5C. <laughs> okay, I'm ready to go. I should be ready to go. And I have power. Let's go for a flight. Hope you enjoy this flight. I rate. Okay, I'm trying to find, there we go. <laughs> Where are we? Above the tree. Yeah, I see it. We're coming down, coming down. We're at the other end of the field, aren't we? <laughs> We're pretty darn far away. Oops, that's too far. Okay. Right the way, okay. So, this is working. Um, it is a little bit difficult to fly this. Uh, the antenna on this goggles, every once in a while, I lose the perception back there. So keep in mind, this is just a 25 milliwatt transceiver. Okay, flying toward the sun, so we're over here. There we are. It works. <laughs> it's working. 
And actually, it's lasted. I'm surprised it lasts this long, you know, of a flight. <laughs> it actually lasts quite a bit of flight time. I don't know if the lights are blinking on this yet, but I'm, I'm just curious, what's going to give first? Is it going to be the quadcopter, or is it going to be uh, the camera? i got a feeling it might be the quadcopter first. <laughs> the, you know. We'll run out of power running the quadcopter. It's starting to get a little bit sluggish right now, so we're about to find out. I'm really at like 80% power right now, so. Yeah, I'm almost out of power, almost out of juice. There, I better bring it in now. <laughs> and bring it down. Bring it toward us. So there I am. I see myself in my tie dye shirt. <laughs> well, this works. And I hope you folks got a chance to see this. So I'm going to bring it down. <laughs> that was fun. FPV flying with the CBX 5C. Hope you enjoyed this flight. This is Quadcopter 101, signing out.